morning to dear students i'm anshu ma'am so today i'm going to start the next topic of chapter 3 structure of matter in previous video i explained you in detail about symbols and formulas so today i'm going to explain you about atomicity atomicity the number of atoms present in a molecule of an element is known as its atomicity the atoms of some elements exist freely in nature like helium neon they exist freely independently in nature so that's why they are known as monoatomic but the atoms of most elements do not exist freely in nature they always form molecules containing two or more atoms so that's why they are known as diatomic for example hydrogen oxygen hydrogen h2 it means one molecule of hydrogen contains two atoms similarly oxygen nitrogen chlorine etc so atomicity means the number of atoms present in a molecule of an element is known as its atomicity now some examples are given here helium symbol is he formula is also he it means the formula chemical formula of the monoatomic elements remains same as their symbol like hydrogen 2 but symbol is h and the formula is h2 they are diatomic for example oxygen symbol is o but its formula is o2 because they are diatomic it means one molecule of hydrogen oxygen and nitrogen contains two atoms so that's why they are termed as diatomic elements let's move to the next topic what information does the formula give for example water h2o we know that the formula of water is h2o now what information do we get from this formula h2o number one the name of elements hydrogen and oxygen so this formula h2o it shows the type of elements found in this formula hydrogen and oxygen the second information which we are getting from this formula h2o is that the number of atoms of each elements present in the compound very easily by just by looking the formula h2o we can say that it contains two elements hydrogen and oxygen and there is two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen so number 2 point is very important that the number of atoms of each elements presents in the compound like hydrogen two atoms and oxygen is equal to one atom and the third information is that h2o the formula h2o represents one molecule of water if we have to represent five molecules of water we can write 5h2o it means 5h2o represents five molecules of water similarly 2h2o represents the two molecule of water now valency the valency of an element or a group denotes its combining capacity let's take an example of hydrochloric acid formula is hcl we can see that in hcl one atom of chlorine combines with one atom of hydrogen so the valency of chlorine is 1 similarly the second example is ammonia nh3 the formula is nh3 we can see in nh3 formula that is the formula of ammonia there is one atom of nitrogen combines with three atoms of hydrogen it means the valency of nitrogen is 3 so this way dear students today i have explained you about atomicity monoatomic diatomic elements the examples information from the formula and valency for more details just read table 3.7 from your science book till then have a nice day thank you